Hello, freaks and geeks, and welcome to another episode of Fallout 4 Survival Mode. And well, this episode we're we're gonna go um, to Nick, uh, back to Diamond City and uh, go back to Nick Valentine, or not exactly back, but we're gonna go meet Nick Valentine. Um, we do uh, we do have this um, what is it? Paras we got some parasites we need to take care of. Thankfully, there's a doctor in town, so. You know, killing some birds with a couple stones. Wait, why is it? Why did it start raining in Diamond City? Oh, hello, kitty. Hello, pussycat. Uh, is the doctor out? Um, it's not a big deal if they're not. Uh, it doesn't look like it. Well, well, uh, the, while the doctor isn't here, we can use uh, this to make some psychojack. Uh, yes. I did actually put some, uh, buff tats. Or not buff tats. I, uh, the reason why I say buff tats is because I'm looking at buff tats. Uh, I did some, put some buff out, um, back in the, um, in the base. I don't know if I have any mint tats, uh, put away. I don't think I actually do. Huh. Uh, it's two o'clock in the morning. So, I don't think the... Hopefully the doctor will be up by the time uh, we'll be uh, done with talking to Nick. Hopefully. Ellie? Are you here? Nick? No, oh, there. Oh, God. It's really you. Well, it's hard to mistake this. Wait, I just noticed. <laughs> Please no... Death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. That's... Okay. The irony. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. Metal detective delivery at your service. Happy to be in a niche market, that's for sure. Here, I know an amount wasn't on the table when you went out to find him, but you deserve a reward. Plus a little something extra. You know, if you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. <laughs> I am actually interested in doing the those cases. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. When you're trying to find someone who's gone missing, the devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. We were in a vault when it happened. Vault 111. It, it was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. A lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. What else can you tell me? There was a man and a woman. They didn't say much. But I remember they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team. Professionals. The kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. Not sure what the backup means, though. Anything else you remember? My wife was murdered. She was trying to keep them from taking Sean, and they, they just. It's OK. You don't need to say anything more. So we're talking about a group of cold hearted killers. But they waited until something. Wait, was what? That, that was violence. Anything else you remember? That, I, I think that was cut off. That, that was very straight. I think that, I really do think that was cut off. Holy shit. Uh, at least whenever I did this with the female character, it, it, it huh. We're looking for my son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care. And a baby needs a lot of it. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the gunners. And of course, there's the Institute. Who were the gunners? High-end mercenaries. No job too brutal. 
the I mean, we met the gunners before. <laughs> you think raiders might have done this? I honestly doubt it. They can barely organize themselves, let alone pull off something this complicated. Wait. Super mutants? What are they? Big, green, muscles on muscles. In other words, hard to miss. I think we can safely rule them out. So you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. If something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs stripped whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, that infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. And I'm a synth myself. A discarded prototype, anyway. You're a prototype? As far as I know. Never seen any other synth like myself. There's the older ones that are dumb as rocks and all metal, and there's the newer ones that are almost human. I'm somewhere in between. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? I'll never forget that voice. Low and rough. Like sandpaper across your face. <laughs> Not much to go on, but a tough and commanding voice can get someone pretty far in the violence business. What else? The man who killed my wife. He had a handgun. I didn't get a clear look at it, but that sound. Could have been a large caliber revolver. Huh. I'm starting to get a clearer picture of the kind of man our perp is. Anything more you can tell me? One of them came right up to me. Bald head. Scar across his left eye. Wait. It couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? I mean, he didn't say they're great. Oh, yeah. I heard their names, their home addresses, and where their diary keys are hidden. All right, all right. Calm down. <laughs> Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned wet stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. You said he lives here? He's still in town? They both vanished a while back. That house is still there. Let you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. Uh. What, Nick, how did you get right there? All right, so I don't think I will actually um follow dog meat um around he's more than just a mercenary professional quick clean thorough has no enemies but they're all dead except you nine to one odds says he's our man more than just you identifying his distinguishing features the mo is all Leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later? Not many mercs in the Commonwealth can pull that off. But yeah, uh, I, I don't think I'm actually gonna go to whatever fort it is or whatever, wherever Kellogg's hiding. I'm, I know where it is, but I'm forgetting what the name of the place uh, is off the top of my head. Because uh, that is a pretty difficult mission. Something to hide, Kellogg. Why don't you give it a try? I might or might or might not. No way I could pick this. So. Nick. No luck. We need to find the key. Hmm. Can't get through that door. See that platform in the distance near the city entrance? That's the elevator to the mayor's office. Why don't you 
go ask around there. I'll stay here and see if I can jimmy this lock. Is the doctor in? No. Okay. I must say, I do kind of like this idea about the mayor's office being up uh, in like the VIP um, seatings or whatever. I guess I don't know where this would be because I'm not exactly a big baseball fan. Easier if you use softer words, honey. Maybe shout a little less. Oh, that reminds me of this article I'm writing about the mayor's affair with a certain airheaded blonde. Oh, look who it is. What brings you to the mayor's office, huh? Uh, hold on. What are you doing here, Piper? Nah, -uh. not until it's in print. You can read all about it in the next issue. If you are done crowding the reception area, Miss Piper, Dick. the mayor needs to make time for more responsible citizens. <laughs> I was just leaving anyway. What what is going on with the NPCs? Na 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 boo boo. <laughs> I don't know why she just walked away, but that works for me. Kellogg must have left something behind. Oh yes, he left. He left a desk fan. How suspicious. What else? Oh, oh, there's some corn. 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 <laughs> Nothing here. Check out that desk. Yeah, I, I mean, I already did, but I'm just also checking for loot. All right, let's uh. Let... Not right. Look for anything out of sorts. A switch. A button. You mean like this? What? What? I think I just picked up a ball peen hammer or something. Gwyneth Stout beer, 44 caliber bullets, and cigars. San Francisco Sunlights. Hmm, interesting brand. Won't lead us ah! on its own, though. What? The great clockwork dick is stumped? It's synth detective, jackass. If you're gonna be that way, you might as well get the make and model right. <laughs> Joking aside, but what about dog meat? Commonwealth mutt like him can track a man sent for miles. Why don't you go fetch him and let him have a whip? See if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. You have to face Kellogg on your own. Just say so. Any words of wisdom? Kellogg really is the one who kidnapped your son. And he's dangerous. So are you. You don't need to be afraid of him or anything else the Commonwealth throws at you. Goodbye, Nick. Hopefully not forever. I want to see you and your kids safe and sound when you get back. Good luck. Anytime you need help, just come knocking. All right, let's finish up looting and uh, never... Whenever we head out, um, dog meat will be waiting for us. Ooh, a pulse grenade. Now the funny thing is, once I actually um, dog actually, meat, get the scent, boy. Once I actually showed dog meat the cigar. Um, I'm trusting my family's future to a dog. That's it. I'm officially crazy. Is that? Dog meat will continue just kind of running off and whatever, and you don't have to follow him, and I don't think I will. Now, uh, is the doctor actually up and about? No? Shut up! No. 
Uh, I'm just gonna wait around. I... Okay, you're gonna take that seat. Shut up, dog. Wait a minute, it's it's Halloween. In in game, I just realized that. <laughs> It's the Hollow Z's. You look fine, but oh, wait. Yeah, that's gonna need to be set back in place. Let's get started. Also, the worms inside my stomach. Well, as you run that way, I'm gonna run this way. All right, so we headed back to uh, Hangman's Alley, and I am gonna turn Righteous Authority into a pistol, and I'm gonna put the Comfort Grip. Um, on it mainly because it's gonna ha um, have the improved recoil and hip fire accuracy on it. I'm not gonna put the short stock on there because because of the better things on it, it has better recoil and aim with scopes improves bash and I don't want to keep the full stock on it because uh, because of the same thing because uh, because of the better recoil aim with scopes and improved bash I'm not gonna put a scope on this thing at least not yet and uh, It's gonna decrease the rate. It's gonna actually improve the range. Uh, the only thing is it's gonna decrease the accuracy a little bit That's fine So overall I, I, I think that's gonna be better for us in the long run nothing really else that we can do really um i mean yeah sure we could actually put a scope on there if we if we really wanted to uh improve sights yeah sure why not but yeah we can't put any muzzle uh apparently we could do some on I, I, i'm guessing this has something to do with the next gen update uh, i don't like that uh but yeah nothing nothing else we could really do with the any of the other pistols really uh i guess we could uh, that's actually some really great range right there yeah we're yeah we're gonna use up all of our screws though doing that yeah you know what i'm thinking about doing actually is that i'm thinking about actually yeah switching that over to har harden receiver and at least for now, putting away uh, the scoped rifle because that's just extra weight that I don't really need to be carrying. All right, so I'm debating or whether or not to actually uh, do the Kellogg mission now or not. It, yeah, sure. I mean, I'm probably very, very under leveled. Um, oh, wait, what? Oh, the DLC has already started? The Far Harbor DLC already started? I... I haven't done that. I haven't done that particular... Uh, I haven't done that particular DLC. I haven't even started it. Um, in any of my other playthroughs. So, that's something... I might think about doing here soon. Alright, I just stocked up on uh, some ammo uh, for the pistol, and I think we're actually going to um, go and do the catalog mission. Ah, uh, yeah, see, it's Happy Halloween at Diamond City, which is actually about to be over. <laughs> Wait, I hear the dog barking, but where where are they? Oh, right there. Hello, dog meat. You, you just been waiting right there? Now, are you actually going to take me by a death claw? Because if you are, I'm going to be noping out of that situation real fast. Not falling for that bullshit. Uh... No, no, uh, death claw. There's usually a death claw. <laughs> That's neat. 
I never noticed that money and jet there before. Where did you go, dog meat? Oh, there you are. Ah! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Just waiting for the mole rats to pop up. I don't know why I follow dog meat. Maybe because I like to follow uh, follow the dog because I know you can sequence break it by just going straight to the fort <gasps> ow This is why I left you at home. Now, if I do remember, yes, there's a bear. Now, are you gonna be a stupid dog and then trigger the bear to come out? Oh. Okay, yeah, that's... <laughs> that's not good. Be a distraction, dog. No, don't run towards me. No. That's not what I wanted. Oh, no. It's a bear. It's a very angry bear! Ah! Isn't there also a stingwing? I could have sworn I also saw a stingwing somewhere. Oh, yes. Are you proud of yourself? Uh... Oh my god, really? Okay then. Super Muta got so close. Why do you, you have to go such a stupid way? Well, anyways, I don't think we're gonna actually do that. I mean, the only reason why I thought about going with dog meat and going and you know, doing that way, or yeah, going that way and you know, doing that mission and everything, was because I wanted to pick up some extra XP and everything. But I'm now I'm thinking about it. I'm. I might as well go ahead and do basically just some brotherhood missions. Wait, what? What note is this? I think I've heard about this mission or something like this from 
an NPC that you can run into. Uh. Uh. Uh oh. I forget. Is it the left or right? Oh my goodness. Oh. Thank you for giving it away. I feel like that's gonna cause a chain reaction. Can't get a good shot on his head. All right, even then, that was a that wasn't a sneak attack. I can smell you out there. Uh. I am a little sneaky snake. And we got our critical back. Yay. Uh, what is this? Oh, Lexington Apartments. Okay. Doesn't seem like a place I want to go into. Uh... What is going on here? Stupid Ballard! What do you mean danger? And great, there's a radiation storm. Uh, what, what is going on? Uh, let's just... Oh no, not rat away, fuck, I meant to do rat X. Whatever. Ah! Well, that was a misclick. What even was going on here? Was there just fighting ghouls? Was that it? I honestly have no idea what there was fighting, so. I guess that's a way for us to get in via the back. Right, can I squeeze through here? Yes, I can. Welcome to the super duper bar. Come on, ghouls. the control panel for that uh, Securitron I know it should be around here somewhere yeah the terminal is it blue no is it free no is it wire no feek it would be kind of funny if it's hate well, I mean there's two Although that doesn't really give me any information. Can really. I mean, I guess. I mean, A, A and E. I'm in. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, I'm just gonna put it on default. Cause I know you have to have a. A hard hat for construction. Don't know what you need for fire brigade. And I know if you fire, if you have a gun and fire at all with law enforcement, they'll turn on you. Same thing with subway. If you don't have a token, they'll get your ass for not, you know, having a subway token or a ticket. So, yeah, I think I'm just going to leave it on default.
Oh, whoops. I thought that would have hit him. Oh, that's a... Okay, that's a Protection Guardian. That I'm glad I'm not against his side. Hello there, ghouls. What? How did that... I'm confused. Well, you take care of that. Wait, how are these melons still good? It's not like people are restocking melons, are they? Oh, I found... I mean, of course you'd find a whole bunch of food in a super duper mart. At least you would hope. Oh yeah, so I'm finding good amounts of food here. Even including a nasty ass street sweet whoa roll. More melons! I mean, at least it's not the last melon. I mean, I am hidden. Okay, good. I was about to say, it's like, if this Protectron actually catches me doing a quote-unquote crime, even though I don't think it's on the proper um, setting, I don't want that Protectron turning hostile. Oh no, oh no, no, no. Burn! Burn, girls, burn! Wait. Uh oh. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna get the flux sensor. Uh, where do I actually have one on my left leg right now? Mm, okay. Yeah, I'll take that. Hello, ghoul friend. Where did you just go? Ah, uh, there you are. That was the nice contortionist vibes you have going on there. Oh my god, this whole entire floor is just... Yep, 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 yep. Come on out. Make yourselves known. And I'll shoot the floor. God, that's a legendary. Okay. All right. One to the head, and then the rest to the body. Ow. All right, that went much better than I thought. Huh. Poi Oh, okay, I I didn't realize I didn't read the pipe um in there. Uh okay, well hmm that actually might give me a reason to use a pipe pist or a pipe um gun. Hmm. That that is very in interesting because I'm not a big fan of um pipe weaponry. At all, but I mean, poisoners. That's that could be useful. It could be it could be useful. Where exactly is this gonna? I shouldn't be leading to a door that I don't know where it goes. I was about to say this doesn't. This seems too quiet.
Huh, what does... Ooh, intelligence one. Ooh. Huh, let's... I, I don't believe I've actually ever heard this, uh, hollow tape. Ah, uh, okay. So this is part, it, in the makes sense because of the laser musket. This is a part of um, uh, Preston Garvey's original team. Okay, I thought the game was just gonna freeze there for a second. No, yeah. Now we're gonna just have to report to Scribe Halen. Oh, Jesus! Okay, uh. What the hell? What the. What the hell? How did that miss? I thought all criticals was not supposed to miss. <laughs> yeah, okay, I just noped out of that situation so fast. Huh, I hear another uh, fusion core thing, but I'm totally fine with uh, not investigating that area right now. I swear, that was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Uh, that critical was not supposed to miss. Like, all criticals are supposed to hit. Oh. Oh, hello there, bloat flies. Oh, okay. I get... Like, okay, that really kind of bothers me how you have to, like, find that particular little piece of the bloat fly to actually, like, gather... ...the... uh, whatever. Uh, am I actually near the, I don't think I'm near the area where the battle takes place. If I am, I don't exactly want to start, start it, uh, uh. What's, <laughs> my god, I swear the. Ragdoll physics are becoming more and more out of hand. Whoa. Uh. Okay, that didn't go as planned. Wait, did that still not kill him? Oh, okay, it did. There's still that one super mutant on the loose. Uh, oh, okay, there's a pack for him. Uh... Oh, oh, okay, are you gonna take care of that one super mutant? Thank you for the assistance. <laughs> Super mutant orders. I, I I always love that. Mercenary, mercenary. Where's the where's your actual Ah, there's your traitor. Uh do you have any uh no you don't. <laughs> do I have any forty four rounds? Fick.
What is that noise? Here's the area. Be careful. Let me guess, it's gonna send me uh, somewhere else. Or somewhere in a DLC area. Gather a uh, greater mass blood clinic? Where exactly is that? Oh, it's down here. Okay. Kind of out of the way, but alright. I was wondering if uh, if that would complete that particular mission or not. Well, since we actually have a level up, let's uh, let's take it. Hmm. Ah, gunslinger is is available. I think we should go ahead and take that since we're primarily running pistols now. Yeah. I know I said I wasn't gonna. Do Kellogg's mission this part especially after that one failed attempt but I think I'm gonna actually uh, actually gonna at least make it to the fort this part and next part we're gonna infiltrate the uh, the base or the fort or whatever have you overland station ah yeah we I forget I forget about this place tato tato don't mind me I'm just picking your tatoes Hello. <laughs> All right. I must say it's a really foggy day today. Oh. Wait, synth. Geronimo? Okay, it's way too short. Yes, I know. You you don't see anything. I really need to get the uh, demolitions export expert here soon. have a gun? I thought they only use laser rifles. Pistols. Wait, why do you have a shotgun? Why did you have a bloody shotgun? I mean, I'm not complaining because, I mean, yeah, you just gave me uh, a better shotgun. A short, yeah, short combat shotgun. Ah, uh, I see. The, the synths killed these scavengers. Those bastards. Uh, yeah, this is the right way. This is the bridge with all the ghouls. I can tr I'm gonna just go ahead and trigger him. Hello, ghoulie friends. Gully. Oh Jesus! Ah! Hello there. Uh, are you gonna shoot? Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Another critical! Another critical! Come on! Well, we're in trouble. Um... Let's just do a quantum. Oh my goodness, we're right next to... Okay. Um... 
Uh, uh, ooh, assassin synth chess piece. Ooh, that's actually pretty good. Um, the only problem is, is don't isn't our current chess piece pocketed? Yes. So I think we're gonna lose a little bit of carry capacity if we put this on. Uh, oh wow, yeah, we lose ten carry capacity if we put that on all right dropped some stuff that we didn't need oh oh get, goodness gracious rats 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 run away from the rats I always forget about the rats here uh what I thought I had a grenade equipped apparently I didn't Huh, okay. <laughs> I do find it weird how sometimes the ghouls will just kind of act like they do. It's like sometimes you can run away from them pretty easily and then they they will just they I don't know, their AI might just bug out. <laughs> and they were just run back to where they spawned or something. I, I honestly don't know. Alert. Critical signs. Alert. Ah, uh, yes. Signs. What have we here? Error. System corrupt. Dog! Feel my legs. Just tell me where Kellogg went, Tin Can. Identity of assailant. Kellogg. All right. <laughs> I do find it funny how the dog just suddenly teleported right there whenever I came across this. We're pretty much there at the... Oh. Is that a bear? Huh? Did I kill that bear? Do I... I don't remember. That's very weird. this our man I did not want to do that but all right all right some boat flies and I know turret should be some turret should be around here oh hello there bloat fly yeah don't go around there because I know there's a bottle cap mine somewhere Around there, yeah. Okay, yeah. There's the there's the flipping turrets. Yes, I know. Stop barking! I get it! Is this the place? Is he in here, boy? Wait, you're not following me. Are you? Wait, am I? Okay, I... I still have... I still technically have the Lone Wanderer, right? Yes. Uh, let's... Hmm. And enter Fort Hagen. Wait, duh! What? What are you doing? I. Hey. Hey. Uh, Wait there. I. F freaking game. I did not want dog meat to fucking be with me, motherfucker. Hello. Ah! Like, just like that, <laughs> I have disappeared, apparently. <laughs> Motherfucker! Jesus! Don't punch me! Hmm. <laughs> I'm kind of...
kind of curious about something. Hmm, okay, yeah, so it doesn't work on actual robots, duly noted. Okay. Now I understand. You are hiding because you fear death. I mean, you're not too entirely wrong there. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Hon, if there's one lightness with hints, and one lightness with Fargo, because none of them share a word that's similar with each other. I swear. It's nice. It, it doesn't make any sense, but I will take that. Go on, Protectron! Kill the rest of them! Uh... Yeah, yeah, you just take care of them down there. I know they're- oh, okay, yep! Yeah. There's two of them. I'm just going to take the critical. Going through slow and methodical. Uh, I hear a turret very close by. Why would there be bloatfly meat in that lunchbox? I mean, you would assume it's pre-roar, that lunchbox, and therefore any food that's in there. Wait, what? No, 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 I, just screw this. I'm gonna shut you down. Go back in your pod. Don't you dare come through that door or that hole in the wall. What the hell? Okay! Since you asked for it, I was trying to shut you down. And I also realized that I said, oh no, I'm not gonna do this mission. I'm gonna just head to the, head to the, you know, forward and I'm not actually gonna go in it oh my god that's a synth leader oh that actually worked oh there we go and just pump the rest into your body Ow, I'm burning! I'm on fire! Wait, I'm still in danger? How? Oh! Because of the laser turret. Anyways, let's uh let's focus on the level up, shall we? Now, don't get me wrong. I I know I've been having some trouble with my throwing arcs and I can actually get rank 2 demolitions expert right away, but I've been kind of my sneak attack my sneak attack criticals hasn't really been doing all that good and I really I really am needing ninja 
So I I don't think I'm going to be doing this twice in a row, maybe. Uh but I Yeah, I I think I'm going to put a point into agility. I don't think I can't exactly remember where the agility bobblehead is uh, out of the first place, but yeah. A uh, moving target is now available. I I am never taken this perk, although looking at it, uh, they can't hurt what they can't get what they can't hit. Get 25 damage and 25 energy resistance when sprinting. That's eh. I mean, you know, that's great while, you know, running away, I guess. Okay, I mean, I guess, I guess, you know, if you're sprinting around and stuff, I guess that would be useful. But it's not, uh, it's not that terribly useful, I think. <laughs> Hello, dog. Go. Psst. Let's go. Uh oh. I just ran into the explosive room. <laughs> Dog me into your existence. It's actually very interesting, because I didn't actually recruit dog meat it, they just the game said you know dog meat is available to be your companion cool i <laughs> didn't exactly ask but i guess cool quit whining i swear that's why i don't like uh like having you around because you're just constantly whining oh There you go. Wait, why are you running back over here? I thought I told you to go get him. Oh shit, there's a Strider. Go on, don't make me kick you. Oh god! <gasps> Talk to me, what are you doing? Hey. Come on. D will that break you out of your. <laughs> You're you useless! Intelligence or endurance? Yeah, I think. Well, it's also about the look. How how do I look? I personally like this one better, but I think the extra endurance is overall better. I don't know. Let me know what what you think. Which one do you prefer? Oh, shit, I did not notice the laser dirt there. 
Dog, get out of the way! Hey. Go there. <laughs> oh, wow, what? How? How am I finding all these fusion cores? I guess one thing, good thing about the dog is that you, is that they can carry stuff. It's it's actually very interesting how the dog is not triggering the lone wanderer, uh, perk to disappear. I guess because they're not an actual person. I guess I don't know. Why would there be psycho in the medical thing? You know what? Don't ask. Now, I do believe if you go back further in here, you do trigger some more sense, but, uh... Ooh, energy weapons, bobblehead. Permanently gain... Ooh, yes. I didn't even real. I didn't even realize that that was there. I... I kind of... For... Hello? Huh. I have detected you. I mean... I guess you've detected the dog. But not me. Just gonna... Sit here and and open these explosives if you don't mind. Sweet. I swear. Protect Kellogg. Ah! I'm just gonna hide in this corner. Da 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 da. Do 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 do. Da, nowhere. Nah, I'm just. I'm hunting. I'm hiding underneath the bed. Movement detected. What? Goodbye. Uh, yeah, yeah, same. Goodbye. I can't hit anything from that window. What the hell? Ah, God! Yeah, come on. Come around the corner. I dare you. That was a lot more difficult than it needed to be. Stop whining, you bitch. Uh, to, to be honest, um, I... No, I would agree with you there. There we go. Dog, move. Stop trying to run ahead. Too late. Stop. Turn around and leave. Okay. What is, it, what is that terminal for? I'm guessing to deactivate the turrets. I don't really care. I can just destroy them very easily. Although that one is very tough for some reason. Ah. Okay then. Hmm, I wonder if picking up the bobblehead triggers them. There we go. No. Okay then. Hello. Is 
Does the other one- does the other- yeah, yeah, yeah. The other one just has the baton. Baton! Wait, where did I even pick that up? I swear the dog runs in front of you whenever you don't want want them to. After this mission, I'm I'm just gonna straight up dismiss him. I honestly don't even know why I'm <laughs> tolerating and having them with me for this mission. Yeah, that, I don't know why that turret is so m much more tougher than all the other ones. I... Why? Why? I swear, this is the last imp... Well, probably not the last impact I'm going to use on you. Since that, you know, sensing or... Since that we're, you know, gonna be facing Kellogg here in just a moment, but, uh, yeah, that, <laughs> that, this is the reason why we leave you at home. Hold on, what, hold on, how, okay, I don't have that much adrenaline, so might as well go ahead and just sleep for an hour, because I'm wanting to try something. It's probably not going to work all that well, but I want to try something. Besides being a bit older than you were expecting, I'm afraid he's not even here. So you see, it is the end of the line. But not the way you imagined. Then you're going to take me to him. Right now. Take you to him. <laughs> like I could, even if I wanted to. Don't you get it? Your son, he's in a place nobody can reach. Sean's safe. At home. In the Institute. The Institute? Well, I'll find him. No matter where he is, nothing will stop me. God, you're persistent. I give you credit. It's the way a father should act. The way I'd be acting if I was in your place, I like to think. Even if it is you. But I think we've been talking long enough okay his voice line just cut got cut sort time. there so it wasn't just me so, earlier you ready you know in a hundred years when I finally die I only hope I go to hell oh okay then <laughs> uh, let's go <laughs> that just took me by surprise all right let's uh let's let's uh, start doing some drugs now Start off by doing some orange mctats. Ah, there we go. Psycho jet. Oh, did I accidentally put all the medics away? Oh, no, I didn't. Okay, there we go. Ah, oh, I didn't cook any that. Ah, oh, shit. All right. Okay, that didn't actually work as well as I thought it was going to do, but yeah. Wait, hold on, what? I know he uses a stealth boy. Ow. Yeah, this is not gonna go well. <laughs> oh, shit. Ah, oh, 
shit. Uh, oh, okay, apparently I actually killed. Grenade! Have more grenades! Have even more grenades! He ah! threw a grenade back! Oh, oh! <laughs> Hello, Kellogg! Oh. Okay, that didn't go as well as I expected it to, but I mean it. <laughs> we killed him in the end. <laughs> this tech, we're barely human. And I think we can sell the rest of this stuff. Yes, I know I'm carrying too much dog meat. Here, carry this shit. All right, now let the folding commence. Or no, folding. Or let the looting commence. I said folding because I saw a folder in the fucking loot thing. Oh my goodness, my brain. Whatever. Uh, and let's get the information from the terminal. By the way, something I didn't exactly realize um, until one of the last times I was here is if it was if it's still here. Yes, you can turn off. He can. Switch the circuit breaker and turn off the lights. Uh, yeah, it's deactivate the turrets. If there's any left. But I. Okay, I was about to say, I thought I opened the doors. And there's the uh, airship. Or the Pridwin. I must say, no matter what time of day or what weather conditions, that's always a great cinematic arrival of the Brotherhood. And there we go, start of the Shadow of Steel, which I do believe we're going to start next time. Yeah, that is... I mean, granted, I don't have that, you know, that powerful of a machine, and I don't believe I have the graphics cranked up all the way to max but that is that is a that is gorgeous anyways as we send dog meat away yeah I didn't expect to uh, to get through as many much as the story missions as we did or uh, yeah, as, yeah <laughs> as far into the story as we did uh, I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm gonna pump the brakes on it for now because whenever we get back to Nick uh, there he's gonna send us to Amari I think at the uh, at the uh, well not Amari but we're gonna go to the um, to the memory lounge and and then after that the glowing sea uh, to meet up with Virgil and that's I don't think we're ready for the glowing sea at the moment. I, I, I really don't think we are. So uh, so next time we're going to, you know, mainly focus on uh, Shadow of Steel and uh, some of the other Brotherhood stuff next time, uh, which I, I I don't mind at all. I, I actually look forward to it because, I mean, we need... We, well, we don't exactly need it, but it would be nice to have a form of fast travel very early on in the game for whenever we actually you know do need it it also would be very useful for whenever we do finally get to virgil virgil's cave so we can actually have a very easy way out of the um glowing sea because uh <laughs> yeah the, the glowing sea isn't fun especially in survival mode it's it's terrifying it's not a nice place i i like it but at the same time i don't I, <laughs> yeah Anyways, 
If you like this episode, please give a like. And if, if you want to see more episodes, please hit that subscribe button. And yeah, kind of, kind of a kind of a mismatch ep episode. I was gonna say, you know, didn't do one thing, and I ended up doing it. So I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>